what, what the mate is talking about. What's up, family? Jerome Adams, the Surgeon General of the United States of America, Donald Trump's boy. He fixed his mouth to say some rather condescending words aimed at blacks and other people of color, specifically Hispanics. He said, in protecting yourselves from COVID-19 and the community at large, you should do it for your abuela, your granddaddy, your big mama, your pop pop. Now, we know that at least that they are reporting that black people are disproportionately dying from COVID-19 and are disproportionately uh, being infected by COVID-19. But for due to specifically just say black folks as if COVID-19 go looking for black people or Hispanics. COVID, I'm COVID-19. Where's the black people? It's very important to note that the reason why they're saying that the numbers are higher for black people is because black people have pre-existing conditions oftentimes like high blood pressure, hypertension, and diabetes. But what they are not telling us is that they are discriminating against black people at many of these so-called health facilities. Yeah, you're gonna tell the truth, tell nothing but the truth. And look, you don't even need a camera to go in there and see. You already know how it goes. Every time that the crisis Anytime the people in the United States of America gets the short end on something, there's a recession, blacks always get the shortest end of the stick. Now, much of this is due to discrimination, systemic racism. That's what it is. Ain't no way around it. Think about it. Well before the coronavirus ever hit, for a very long time in America, black people would go to the doctor's office and they just didn't try as hard to save their lives. Now I know some of y'all sitting back, well, what you mean, man, what you mean? You know what the hell I mean. Black people come in there and Oftentimes, they don't give them the same amount of care as they would give someone else. I'm not even talking about insurance and all of that stuff. Even if you have insurance, sometimes you won't get the same amount of care. Do I need to remind you of Martin Luther King Jr.? Can't trust him. This is why if I ever go to the hospital, I need somebody in there with me at all times. I need somebody in there that I trust with me at all times. I do not trust them one bit. And then what they're doing in China, kicking black people out of their homes, out of the hotel rooms, putting them out on the streets. I mean, people can't even get out of the city. They can't get out of the country because the airports are locked down. They're closed. So even the people that got money to get out can't get out. They're just out on the streets. And I guess the plan is to let them die because a memo went out from what I understand to all Chinese people to refuse them services, meaning that if they try to go in the store and buy them something to eat, they can't even buy anything to eat. They're trying to starve them out. It's like they want them to die. They just got them out in the streets. 
exposed to the elements and just basically waiting on them to die. You never know. They may just start, they may start executing them. I wouldn't be surprised. They're real bold with it. But this is just one more reminder that we're on our own. And this uh, Sambo that old dude got working for him, he got him as the face. And it, believe you me, when everything go bad, he gonna blame the black dude. Watch, they put a black dude up in the front so that when things go wrong, they can blame him. Trust me, he's gonna fall out with Jerome. Trump is going to fall out with Jerome and they're gonna blame everything on him. <laughs> That's why he's there. Some people say, well, you know what he said ain't all that bad. Black people do need to you know, watch themselves. You know, we do need to be more careful and take care of themselves. Uh, well, so does a lot of other people, but he didn't signal, signal them out. Yeah. Now, I just look at who he worked for, who he riding for, who he's riding with, and I can make my mind up as to what type of dude he is. No more talk. What the ladies talking about?